one of the big premises of HTML5 is that it eliminates the need of having a flash player to embed video. And if you use the correct format or formats, it should play on pretty much any browser. I'm currently working on a Mac laptop. I have three different browsers that I'm using. I have Safari, I have Firefox, and I have Chrome. And this is the exact same page. In this video, I'm going to go through the basics of setting up a form. And it display. you'll notice that each one displays differently. I did not specify size. I also have sound on each one of these. This is a very simple. Where I have a simple recording, obviously. This is a very simple recording that I'm going to simple recording that I'm going to use to demonstrate. So you can watch these or listen to them if you wish. And I have links to the source for each of these. For each one, to make it work on any browser, you need two sources. For the video, you need MP4 and WebM. All of the major browsers use one of those two. Sounds, MP3, or .ogg. Every major browser uses one of those two. To get these resources, you will just um, okay, I'm in Safari. Download linked file as. Or save link as. And it will give you the option of where to save it. So this gives you the files for you to recreate this page and make it work. Now, you know that I grade where the average is a 70%. The average student will take my content and reuse it, and that's fine. That's average. It gets you 70%. If you want the 100% on the assignment, create your own content. You can take content off of an iPhone or any smartphone for both video and sound. There's online converters. Just Google them to convert into the formats that you need, and you need MP4 and WebM for movie and MP3 and OGG for sound. And there's lots of free online converters that you can just Google and use. So if you want 100%, make sure to create your own content. Let's look at the source code. Okay, I'm in the Firefox one, which is my preference. And I've kept it really simple. I have hardly even styled it. I just can't stand sans serif font, so I've changed that. Um, so you'll see that for the video, I have controls equals controls. This puts your playhead on it. And then I have two sources, forms.webm and forms.mp4. And it will use the first one that it runs into that is supported by the browser. Same thing for the audio, samplesound.mp3, samplesound.ogg, and they work in all of the browsers. So again, if you just want to make your basic page, I want you to try this and make the video and the audio work. You can use mine by downloading them or you can create your own, which is what I'd prefer to see you do.